Hi, Paul Slackers. Woodstock forever. Peace, love, and hope. Good News Planet, Good News Broadcast. So I'm here on 48th and 3rd, and I'm looking at Albert Einstein riding a uh, motorcycle, wearing all different colored uh, outfit, and on a bicycle. Actually, it's a bicycle, not a motorcycle. He has a, uh, a plate that says to me, peace equals love or the heart squared. That's the bottom line as far as I see it as well. But look at this great, great uh, piece of artwork. Could that have actually been drawn on there by this guy, Cobra? Literally on the brick? Let's see. Wow, it's a real installation. Now what is that over there? Is that a camera? Is that a computer? Uh, that looks like the flag of Brazil. There's an environmentalist over here for us. I was collecting those bottles and returning those bottles and compacting those bottles are environmentalists. Let's go back a little bit. Cobra. This is pretty wild. I keep walking back. But I'm going to learn more about this. Hey, Hank. Hey, Ben. This is pretty darn cool, if you ask me. Well, we know New York is pretty darn cool. So, peace equals a heart or love squared. One time the New York Times wrote that uh, love is stronger than gravity. But I'm going to just add uh, one thing here because I think it's important on a weekend that they have deemed to be Memorial Day. Uh, in due respect of all those who have fought for freedom or for the belief of and concern of safety around the world. I uh, pay my due respects to all those with the dream and with the desire on this holiday time. It's interesting to say how many uh, days are considered holidays when they're actually war days uh, and murder days and killing days. But uh, love equals uh, Peace. Peace equals love squared. Okay, so uh, in due respect of the Memorial Day, this is our special, actually. Albert Einstein, who uh, I want to give a quote about Albert Einstein just because uh, I did a paper, <laughs> I think in junior high school with him, when I was co-captain with Bruce Jenner, or the, high, the whatever team that was, uh, the track. Okay, so, uh, uh, Caitlin to those now. Um, in that paper, I, I wrote uh, what he wrote and what he said. So what Albert Einstein said, if I would have known what my discovery would have created, I would have become a carpenter. So those that might not know that Albert Einstein's uh, creation, invention, became the atom bomb. So uh, everyone, this is uh, our memorial day uh, uh, commentary and I wish you all uh, health, safety and, and peace and love and hope in, in your lives. If you want to go take a look at our Woodstock Forever Peace, Love and Hope uh, movie, uh, please do. We also have a questionnaire. I got to get more people to fill it out. That would be very helpful. So you could actually, you could even text me. I'm not so. 917-687-1790 and I'll send you uh, the link for the Peace, Love and Hope uh, survey. But we're finalizing and we're all excited to uh, share Woodstock Forever, uh, Peace, Love and Hope because we did the 20th anniversary of Woodstock with Richie Havens in uh, Times Square.
um, and Woodstock 50th is happening this year. So we're really focused. Uh, we're going to come out with a book, uh, a, a hugging game. It's called Hug of War. <laughs> uh, a lot of good stuff. All right, everybody. Well, Howard, Christina, what's for dinner? No, Bill. <laughs> All right, everybody. I love you. Thank you. And uh, uh, I, I, the parting words for me is uh, enjoy every moment. Thank you.